Good day, everyone. My name is Maria Konjelska, and this is Poland Daily Culture. Our today's guest is one of the most recognizable Polish musicians, composer, guitar player, a member of numerous reggae and rock bands, ladies and gentlemen, Dariusz Malejonek. Hello to everyone. Glad to be here. Thank you for being with us. But before we start the interview, let's, of course, listen to some of his music. Yes. Szczęśliwi ci, których droga nieskalana, którzy postępują według twego prawa. Szczęśliwi, którzy zachowują napomnienia Pana, całym sercem go szukają. Ci, którzy nie czynią nieprawości, lecz kroczą jego drogami. Gdy strzec będę twoich przekazań, As a musician, you took part in a project called Decalogue. Mm -hmm, yeah. There are 10 commandments and 10 different musicians are making and composing and then mm -hmm. later uh, producing the songs about this specific commandment. And you had the ninth commandment, you shall not covet your neighbor's wife. Mm -hmm. And tell me, uh, why did you take part in this project and how yeah. did you approach it as well? I think the Decalogue is uh, something that is, uh, you know, uh, forget in... in uh, it's forgotten. <laughs> it's, it's forgotten in our modern times, yeah? that the people think that it's, uh, it's uh, something not, not trendy, it's uh, that we can live uh, freely and we can do uh, what we want to do, yeah? <laughs> and, uh, uh, and I think that is, um, the, uh, it causes it's so much problems in, in the earth, in the, in, especially in Western Europe, yeah? When the face is uh, going down. <laughs> and, uh, and I think that without the Decalogue, without the 10 words uh, of, li of life, yes, uh, um, it's, uh, that it's it, it, do, we can find a way, uh, find a, way our path in life our, yes 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 because it's like that we for example we are on a desert and if we don't know uh, way, way yeah <laughs> to go which way to go we are we are we will die yeah so it's a uh, decalogue is it, uh, something like this yes. yeah so we, i think it's uh, very important uh, in our times and we climbed to uh, on a <laughs> In the, uh, in the biggest mountains exactly. so of Poland. Exactly, so you took this song with you, yeah. and this commandment as well, and you climbed Mont Blanc. Yeah, we, we had uh, small tablets <laughs> <laughs> with ten commandments. They were quite heavy, yeah, but it was <laughs> not original ones. <laughs> of course. Uh, of course, but uh, they were, and we started, we tried to climb Mont, Mont Blanc, yes. How far did you get? Ah, we about 4,000 meters above the uh, sea, but we, we can't reach the top because of weather, yes, because was, the weather was, was changed and uh, we should came back, but uh, we were 4,000 4, meters, it meters was quite... Uh, sea level, it's yeah. It's quite high. We have a uh, priest, you know, with us, and, and we made uh, uh, mass, yeah? <laughs> so you carry the Above mass? Above all <laughs> Europe, yes, and uh, that Europe should remember about Decalogue if he want to stay alive. That's and a very uh, strong statement, I would yeah. say. <laughs> but probably true. I think so. And how this project, how this undertaking and taking part in it changed you in a way? Do you feel that or mm -hmm. also because you're not the only musician who took part in that. There were others. Yes, it was really great, great musician. Marcin Pospieszalski uh, was the head of uh, the musical project and uh, he invited uh, some, some musicians like me and uh, many more. And we uh, uh, 
Michal Lawrence. And uh, before this, we were with these tablets. We were in uh, Holy Land and, and Mount, Mount Sinai. Yeah. Uh, we climbed Mount Sinai with the <laughs> with the oh, with this tablet mountain, yeah. with uh, with Marek Kaminski also. I see. Mm -hmm. Yeah, very uh, very famous tra traveler. Traveler, yeah. yeah. And uh, it was really great opportunity to 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 feel uh, the, um, to be on this uh, in Mount Mount Sinai was uh, near this place when uh, Moses yeah <laughs> were, arrived. Yeah, well. it was a really great great experience for us. And after this year after we 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 tried to climb on the Mont Blanc. Mont Blanc. Mm. And tell me, please, do you, do you observe any change in your audience when you're touching such topics? And when mm -hmm. you're showing, here, me, a reggae and a rock musician, oh, is touching Ten Commandments. You mean, yes, and I can say some testimonies about the uh, you know, people who, who were, for, for example, they were coming to our concert and they, for example, were non-believer. And uh, after in the, the concert, some, something, change in their okay. lives, in, in their souls. And for, for example, one guy wrote me uh, that he, he was uh, drunk and uh, in, uh, stoned with, with, uh, on drugs. And he, he came to, you know, to concert by accident, yeah? But he, he told that it was changed his life. And now he ha he's a uh, uh, father of five, Five children. Yes. Quick. <laughs> yeah. No, it was 20 years ago. I ah, think. yeah. So, and he uh, now is planning to go to China as a volunteer, as a uh, missionary. Yes. Wow. Yeah. So it's really changed so it's his a, life. And I've, I can tell you many stories like this. Yeah. That it was, uh, for example, one guy who who was depressed because he was. Uh, uh, after divorce, with uh, uh, he stayed, uh, you know, alone, uh, depression, was yes. depressed and started to drink, uh, and uh, you know, someone gave him our <laughs> CD, <laughs> yes, Malorek Rockers, and this helped helped him to to stand on his own feet, yes, and uh, to feel better and start to hope, yeah, hope. Hope is the, <laughs> the key. Everyone who forgot the Ten Commandments or who has a Decalogue somewhere in the back of their minds, but not in an everyday life, those songs, songs which tell the truth and which tell the hope, and one of them of Dadek Malayanek is absolutely for you. And thank you for watching Poland Daily Culture.